wow, this is so beautiful. Oh, wow, Asha. I found an animal track. You sure did. Let's have a look and see which animal this track belongs to. It looks like it was two big solid prints. Wow, and it's bigger than my hand. Wow, it sure is. I think I know who this track belongs to. It was made by a giraffe. Oh, hello there, friends. We're so glad that you're here and you're just in time to explore with us. Byron just found an animal track that belongs to a giraffe. How wonderful is that? Can we please look for some more animal tracks? Yes, of course. Friends, how about this? When we find an animal track, you can tell us which animal the track belongs to. We will also be giving you some clues to help you. Boys and girls, I know you are all so clever. Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Now, what animal do you think made this track? Hmm. Let me give you a little clue. Its stripes run white and black across its nose and down its back. Boys and girls, what has black and white stripes? Shout it out if you know what this is. It's a... Zebra. Yes, a zebra. Now on to our next track. What animal do you think made this track? Here is a clue. It likes to hop around, it croaks, and it catches flies with its long tongue. Can you tell me, girls and boys, it's a... Frog. Yes. That print belongs to a frog. Next, we have a very interesting looking animal print. Oh wow, look at this track. It's so big and so round. Byron, please share the clue with our friends. It's gray and one of the largest animals. It has a large trunk. Ooh, what do you think, friends? I think you know what this animal is. It's a... Elephant. Yes. Well done, girls and boys, you got it right. Now here is our last track. Let's see if you know who this animal track belongs to. What do we have here? Hmm. Um, is that a track of a cat? No, it's not, but you're close. Here's a clue. When it's happy, its tail wiggles. If it licks your hand, I'm sure you'll giggle. Um, oh, I think I know. Does this animal make the sound woof woof? Yes, you got it, friends. It's a... Dog. Yes. We can see wonderful things that God made everywhere we look. And I'm so glad that God made me and God made you and God made you because God made everything. Who made everything, Bangani? God made everything. You've got it. The Bible teaches us that God saw everything he had made and it was very good. Genesis 1 verse 31. Now let's all say our memory verse together with emotions. Come on, Bangani, do it with us. Are you ready, Byron? Yes. Let's go in three, two, one. God saw everything he had made and it was very good. Genesis 1, verse 31. Good job, everyone. You remembered our memory verse. Now it's time for our Bible story, where we learn more and more about what God made. Do you want to hear what God made on day six? Yes! Yes, please. Great! to talk about all the wonderful things that God made. And remember, God made everything. And we can read about the things God made in the Bible. Byron, can you remember what God made on day five? God made the fish and the birds. Yes, he did. But God wasn't finished yet. On day six, God made all the animals. God made giraffes. God made elephants, God made rabbits, God made cows, snakes, sheep, zebras, lions, cats, and so many more. When you look at all the animals God made, you see just how loving and creative God is. But God still wasn't finished because on day six, God also made his most 
special creation. Everyone give me a big drum roll on your legs like this. Woo! On day six, God created people. God made the first man and named him Adam. And the first woman and named her Eve. God told Adam and Eve to eat the fruit from the trees in the garden and to watch over all the animals. God made Adam and Eve in God's own image because they were his children. God saw all that he had made and he said, that's good. Say that with me. That's, that's good. good. Actually, after God made people and was finished with creation, when God looked at all that he had made, he even said, that's very good. Say that with me. That's, that's very, very good. good. Let's see if we can remember what God made on all those days. On day one, God made the light and the dark. Yes. On day two, God made the sky over the water. On day three, God made the plants, land and sea. Yes. On day four, God made the moon and the stars and the sun. Yes. On day five, God made the fish and the birds. And on day six, he made animals and people. That's right. Great job, friends. Let's see how fast we can go through day one to day six of what God has made. Are you ready, everyone? Let's take a deep breath. Day one, light and dark. Day two, sky over water. Day three, land, plants and sea. Day four, the sun, moon and stars. Day five, fish and birds. Day six, animals and people. <laughs> Tell me everyone, who made everything? God made everything. You've got it. God made everything, including wonderful and amazing you. I'm so glad that God made me and God made you, and God made you, and God made you. Let's pray and thank God for making us. Let's close our eyes and fold our hands. Father God, wow. Thank you for making so many wonderful animals and so many people. Thank you for making each and every boy and girl watching this video. Thank you for making us. You made people because you love us and you wanted a family. And you sent Jesus to be our friend forever. Thank you, Father God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Wow, everyone, let's remember that. God made all the animals. Then God made his most amazing and most precious creation, people. We are God's most awesome and precious creation. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Got it. Great, boys and girls. You are God's most amazing and precious creation. He loves you so much. Remember that every time you look in the mirror. Salani kafle bangani. Bye. I clap my hands and stomp my feet because I love the way that God made me. I move my head and shake my knees because I love the way that God made me. I wake up in the morning and I wiggle my toes, wiggle my toes, oh. I stretch out my arms and I'm scratching my nose, scratching my nose, oh. So I clap my hands and stomp my feet. I love the way that God made me I move my head and shake my knees Because I love the way that God made me I love the way that God made me Oh, I love the way that God made me Oh, I love the way that God made me Oh, I love the way I love the way He made all the birds He made all the trees He made all the trees Oh 
He made all the fishes swimming in the sea, swimming in the sea, oh. So I clap my hands and stomp my 